Hey everybody, welcome back to another brand new episode of Mystery Box Monday. Today we've got, looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, maybe seven packages to open up, including the return of Walk Off Wax. They sent something in, and we're going to start things off with Deuces Wild. I pre-opened all of the packages to speed things along, because i got a Little League game to go to in just a little bit, and I uh, don't want to be late. But anyway, if you have something to send to us, for Mystery Box Monday, you can send it to Jabs Family Attention Mystery Box Monday, so I know that it's for this series and not an eBay purchase that I had. Pleasant Unity PA 15676, PO Box 402, Pleasant Unity PA 15676, and I will get it opened up. So, we oftentimes have a lot of eBay sellers, Facebook sellers, Instagram sellers, folks with their own websites that are selling cards, and this is a nice way to see what's out there. So let's go ahead and start off. Deuce is wild. Don't know what's in here. There is a note, however. Let's see what we've got. So inside this very first one, I feel like that name sounds familiar. It says, first off, I want to say thank you for opening my very first mystery pack edition, Only the Hits, on the channel last year. They ended up doing pretty darn well, and since then I've been hard at work building up an inventory for even better and more ambitious of a mystery pack. I present to you the only, the Slabs Mystery Pack. That's right, each pack will consist of three PSA 9 or 10 graded cards. These packs are prospect and rookie focus. Each pack will contain a Julio Rodriguez or Jackson Merrill first edition, first Bowman card. And each pack will have one graded PSA vintage or retro player. And those cards could be a mixture of PSA 6, 7, or 8 for a grand total of four slabs, all from PSA. But wait, there's more. These packs will be littered with bonuses, including additional slabs, as well as prospect packs that will contain first Bowman base, chromes, mojos, or sapphire cards. He's selling these for $115 a piece, plus shipping. This is a limited run of only 20 packs made, so they might not last all that long. It says, I've included the player list for both the prospect and vintage players, so everyone knows exactly what the player pool is. That's really, really transparent. I'm glad that you did that. Always nice to have uh, mystery packs that actually have a checklist. Uh, it says, there will be no one included in this run that is not on this list. I don't juice any packs, including yours, and there's no chasers. Just a whole lot of fun for the fair price. I'd love to hear the thoughts from the viewers. Now, if you want to grab one of these Deuces Wild packs, here's the code 256077122479. If you type that into eBay, it will bring it right up as long as there's still inventory left over. Here's the checklist. You can pause it and take a look at it. The checklist of all the different slabbed up players. All right, so let's go ahead and see what we have inside. Looks like we have, obviously, a whole bunch of slabs right there and some bonuses as well. We'll start off with the bonus pack here, a little team bag with a Henry Mendez on the back. I'm going to go ahead and adjust my cameras a little bit. There we go. Michael Morales is first up, Eddie's Leonard. Next, Jonathan Class A, Mojo first, Enzo Guzman first, and Henry Mendez first. So some nice first mojos in there. And let's check the slabs. On the back, we have a J-Rod PSA 9 as a bonus. That is a nice one right there. It's Holiday Rookie Card in a PSA 9. Definitely will take that one. And that doesn't even count towards the four slabs that are going to be in here. One of them is going to be a vintage one. So let's check them out. First up, we have a Trey Sweeney. Nice prospect there. That's a PSA 9. From the National Bowman Chrome National Edition. Number on the back to 50 not too bad next and i do like the fact that they're using spacers to hide the uh the drama we've got a 2022 bowman wilman wilmin condelario first bowman auto in a psa 9 next up we have our vintage lab it's a chipper jones rookie card 1991 upper deck in a psa 6 and the final card in deuces wild slab packs it's going to be jackson merrill first 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 Bowman first edition, and that is a PSA 10. Great card right there. So there you have it. That's our first one up. Pretty good one. Deuces Wild. Check it out on eBay while they last. Next up, we've got Walk Off Wax is back. Walk Off Wax has been featured on the channel several times. Uh, for those of you that are new to this, they've gotten mixed results and uh, mixed feedback in the past. We've had some people that have just been very unhappy with them and other people that have been happy with their products. Um, so let's go ahead and see what we've got here. I would encourage you to go back and read the comments of uh, the other walk-off wax videos. You can type in Jabs Family Walk-Off Wax 
and check out the comments there to get the full rundown of these. Uh, I know when they first came in on the scene, they bit off a little more than they can chew and promised everyone a free pack of cards. And um, I guess that was uh, just a little too much. But anyway, it says, uh, just a quick note, uh, last few weeks I've been noticing videos featuring the world's most expensive packs only, only to be followed by even more expensive. We have nothing against the makers of these and buyers are lucky enough to be able to afford them. However, we, we wanted to show your subscribers the flip side of those. So welcome to the least expensive mystery packs out there. Walk off wax silver pouches featuring a slab card or relic for the low price of free. So zero dollars for these packs right here. It says, that's right, buy a walk-off wax mega blaster on walkoffwax.com and then you get a free 2023 pouch included with every box purchase. Not only did we lower the cost of the mega blasters from 40 to 35 to help offset shipping costs, but we have a 2023 top series one and 2023 Bowen packs sprinkled in throughout the products. It says we included our latest mega blaster along with three silver pack advanced uh, examples the subscribers to see it says as always thanks jeb sincerely randy from walk off wax so here's the mega blaster it's 35 dollars. i guess you buy this and you get this tossed in it says uh he made 250 of these 2023 series one so let's go ahead and check these out typically there's some uh some packs in here a mixture of hobby and retail and let's go ahead and see what we've got in this first box you see a whole bunch of packs there looks like some older ones you got 2019 optic in there you've got 2019 top series one uh, that's a hobby pack you've got 2022 series one which is a hobby pack you've got a big league hobby pack from 2020 a bowman chrome from 2021 upper deck from 91 got some of those national baseball card day packs it looks like 95 don russ is in here 99 top series two we've got series one that's a retail pack and a slab so it's a good selection of packs for 35 dollars i mean um can't really beat that you know let's see what we've got here we'll start off with the 91 upper deck pack and we'll do a quick look and see if we can find the michael jordan short print we've got a hank aaron baseball heroes card in there there's a jeff bagwell that's Jeff Bagwell's rookie year, rookie threats card, along with Luis Gonzalez. And nothing else going on there. Let's check out the 2020 Big League pack. We've got Nelly Cruz on the top looking for Luis Robert or maybe a Bo Bichette or Jordan Alvarez. Unfortunately, don't get any of those. The Bowman Chrome, I call these the cold packs because with the Bowman Chrome Megas, the Chrome Packs won't really have anything in them. All the good stuff's in the Megas. By the way, the Mega Boxes are coming on May 31st. So not all that far away, we'll be getting into the Mega Boxes of Bowman Chrome. Looking forward to that as we take a look at the Series 1 pack from last year, 2022. Looking for Wander Franco. Also, folks, we have a live stream tomorrow night. It will be the... Team Break Tuesday. Sign-ups going on right now on Patreon. If you'd like to grab a spot, just head on over to Patreon if you're signed up there. If you're not, you can still join. There's a Ronald Acuna Gold Cup card. Go ahead and put that one aside. That's probably the best card so far of these packs. JT Rail Muto right there. And Matt Olson. Let's try our 2019 optic and see if we can pull Vladdy Rookie out of this. Cal Quantrill's on the back. Juan Soto, second-year card. Mike Trout, overall. Not a bad pack with a Trout and Soto in there for sure. We'll put those guys off to the side. 95 Donruss. I'm, I haven't opened much of this, and I would not be surprised if this is bricked. And uh, it is sticking. You can hear it right there. So kind of bricked up. Unfortunately, we won't be able to go through those because they're all sticking together. I don't want to go ahead and peel those apart. 99 Series 2. We did this for a Throwback Thursday about a year ago, I think. And uh, let's see if we're lucky enough to have these not stick together. And we are. So it looks like each Mega Blaster from Walk Off Wax, you get a selection of packs. You won't always get these same packs. You may get completely different packs. But it looks like you also get a slab in there as well. Let's check the retail pack. Oh, this one's from a, uh, I can feel it. That one is from a super box. I can feel the stickiness on the, the pack wrapper. They always glue all those packs together. There's Raphael Devers. Kyle Stowers in there. And we have these two little, I guess, uh, fun packs right here. These are from 2011. We'll check them out. Looks like they're from Series 1. Maybe there will be a Freddie Freeman or Chris Sale rookie card in one of these. That'd be nice. They're both from Series 1. Looks like little five-card packs here. We've got Alex Rios on the top. 
And Lucas Duda, rookie card, is in there. Roy Halladay. Manny Ramirez. Hey, we got Freddie Freeman, rookie card. Very nice. How about that? Freddie Freeman, rookie, in the little 2011 Tops uh, five-card pack. That's awesome. In great shape, too. Very, very nice. Freddie Freeman, rookie card. Awesome. Let's check out the slab. And it is going to be... A, it is Kyle Lewis in a PSA 10. That's uh, that's kind of like uh, the meme. That's the, the mo most memed slab out there. Kyle Lewis PSA 10 is worth about five bucks because everyone got that card graded. And uh, it's, uh, man, just completely worthless now. All right, here's these freebies. You get this three packs plus a slabbed up card as well. So I guess you get one of these with your... Um, box. We have a Bowman Chrome Pack from 2021. Let's go ahead and rip this open. Kebron Hayes rookie card. Jazz Chisholm rookie card. Hey, all rookie cards in that pack. Not too bad right there. We'll take those. We have a 2021 or 2020 Tops Pack here. This is going to be a hobby pack of 2020. So keep an eye out for the Bo Bichette and Jordan Alvarez rookie cards. And we have a silver foil of Michael Chavis. Nothing else in there. Hey, we've got another chance, another Freddie Freeman or Chris Sale rookie card. This is a Series 1 pack from 2011. I didn't get it that time. Let's check the slab. See if it's any good. Might be another Kyle Lewis. Could be Aristides Aquino or it could be maybe Luis Robert. That would be a nice one. Robert's been going up and up. It's Mike Trout. That's a nice one right there. PSA 8, Mike Trout. It's a retail blue parallel as well. So Mike Trout is the bonus hit. That's way better than the Kyle Lewis in my book. All right, next one up. Next freebie pack. And I th it looks like he made 250 of these. And again, feel free to leave your comments from Walk Off Wax. I know maybe he owed some of you guys packs. And, and if he's made good, let us know. Here is the 2022 Series 1. Pack. Nothing going on in there. We've got a mega box pack from 2021 Chrome Update. Every now and then you'll find something good in there. Jonathan India and Tyler Stevenson rookie cards. And we have an 87 Don Russ pack here looking for Barry Bonds, Bo Jackson, Barry Larkin. Good old Rob Wilfong, friend of the channel. Not really, just uh, he terrorized us in one of those breaks. He kept coming out over and over again. Hey, Jose Canseco. Not a bad card right there. I used to love that card. Next best thing to have in his 86 Don Ross was having his 87 Don Ross. All right, here we go. This feels like a BGS slab. It is a little thicker. Let's see what we've got in this next one. It is going to be, it's actually going to be a CSG slab. It's Alec Manoa. It's going to be his 2021 Bowman Chrome. It's his prospect card, and it's numbered out of 199, and it is a CSG 9. Here's our last freebie pack. Check this one out and see what we've got here. Another optic pack from 2019. Go after that Vladdy rookie one more time. Pete Alonso rookie, very nice. So Pete Alonso optic rookie card. I've been buying up Pete Alonso's whenever I get a shot at it. You saw my, I don't know, maybe you didn't, but you checked out my video from the card show yesterday. I picked up a bunch of Pete Alonso's and we have an autograph in our stadium club hobby pack. It's Shunjin Ryu, that's pretty cool. Swinging a bat. So, having some luck with some of these packs. And here's 87 tops. Teddy Higuera on the back, which my brother and I used to call him Teddy Hugger. Hey, there's the infamous Ed Lynch mid-burp card. One of the worst cards of all time. I don't know. Ted Lynch must have really made somebody mad at tops that they went and put the absolute worst possible picture that they could find of him, Ted Lynch mid burp unless he hated getting his picture taken just did that on purpose and that was the best picture they could get of him here's our slab i took that ed lynch and i put it in the good pile why did i do that the slab is going to be a robert powelson it's a psa 10 he's a prospect that was big back in the day but has really not done much uh recently kind of a fading prospect we'll see if he can maybe get it back psa 10 robert powelson bowman first edition all right, so Walk Off Wax, thanks very much for your submission. You can check them out if you'd like to on their website. And now let's continue on 
we have next up, we'll go with this bad boy right here. This menacing face looking at it. Us, it is from Phoenix. It says, my name is Phoenix and I'm back with Stealth Card Series 2. The first series that was shown on your channel a while back sold very well and got amazing reviews. These, or this series will be even better than the last one with many great cards, including multiple one-of-ones. It will contain two different packs, a hit pack and a stars and rookies pack. You get 20 cards, great rookies, three hits in the hit pack, two autos and a relic. One out of five packs has a PSA graded card. The mystery packs will start off at $35 and they'll be shipped throughout the U.S. You can hit them up on Instagram. And uh, if you want to buy one of these, 35 bucks, type in this code, 185-902-344-504. It'll bring it right up. So let's check it out. Stealth cards. Let's see what we have here. We need some new scissors. These scissors are so dull. All right. I have to hop on Amazon and buy some. Let's see what we've got. So we've got a Bobby Witt Jr. rookie card. That is a nice one right there. Bowman Sterling, Ozzy Albies, Rose Chapman, Michael Taylor rookie card, Kyle Lewis Green rookie. There's another Ozzy Albies. That one a rookie card. Xander Bogarts, Cattell Marte, Chrome rookie, Chris Bryant rookie card. Nolan Arenado, Topps Bunt, Joe Adele rookie, Kirloff rookie. So definitely some nice cards sprinkled in. A foil board right there and a Sean Murphy purple rookie card top loaded up. It's numbered out of 75. Sean Murphy, great player. And here's the hits. Three hits in this hit pack. And we've got Wade Boggs, game used bat, leading things off. A printing plate of Josh Naylor. That's pretty nice. Josh Naylor. From the Indians, or Guardians, I should say. Printing plate, auto. That is from 2014 Leaf. And Christian Hernandez autograph. Nice prospect there. So very good product, it looks like. Stealth cards. Here's the code once again if you want to go and try one of those for 35 bucks. And as always, with any eBay seller, always check that feedback and make sure everything checks out. All right, next one up, we have these guys. Slab. All right, this is going to be a 70, no, $89.95, dollar pack. This could be nice. It says, thanks for the numerous feedback on your first opening of these mystery packs on your channel. I appreciate the feedback from everyone. It says, we've listened to the feedback and hopefully we've made a change for the better. We've removed the fluff and added more of the good stuff. We've added some PSA slabs in the packs and the chase slabs are listed right here. Bobby Witt, J-Rod, Max Kepler, one of one. It says, the packs were 90 bucks plus free shipping. The packs include a PSA 8 or higher slab, 2 to 4 autographs, 3 to 5 numbered cards, numerous rookies and parallels, and one sealed pack of Chrome Update Sapphire from 2022. It says, if you like the mystery pack without the Sapphire, then submit an offer for $75 and they will send you this pack just without the Sapphire pack. So if you want to save a little bit of money, you can do that. It says, I've included the mystery pack without the Sapphire. So this is the $75 one. It says, thanks again. Uh, all purchases will ship out next business day. And if you like what you see from Michael at MC Collectibles, you can type in this eBay code, 364-133-200-023. That number will bring this right up. And if they still have inventory left, you'll be able to grab one of these. So 75 bucks is the price. Or you can go with the uh, $90 price and get a Sapphire pack there. Let's see what we've got inside here we start things off with a Wander Franco rookie card Rodolfo Castro orange from gallery out of 25 we got Trey Mancini right there logo man a Bryson Stott green rookie auto that's a nice one should be out of 99 right yep 73 of 99 Bryce Harper green numbered to 99 as well O'Neill Cruz rookie card another Cruz DJ LeMahieu we got a J-Rod that's gonna be a printer proof rookie and Mike Trout Pink in there as well. So definitely some nice ones in that stack. Let's check the next one. I see a Jeremy Pena hit coming up. Right there. Looks like a manufactured relic. Chad Green, Independence Day. That's going to be out of 76. Samuel Munoz, first Bowman Auto. Ricky Henderson, Team Color Match Green. Carlos Santana, X Fractor. Zach Short, Prism Fractor. And look at that, a Luis Robert. Wow. Luis Robert Rookie Auto is in there. That is freaking awesome. I'm going to just go ahead and turn right around and put this one up in my PC cabinet. You guys know that I've been a Luis Robert fan for a long time. And uh, that's amazing. So awesome card right there. That's my favorite card of the day so far. 
And we've got Jerry Pena, manufactured batting helmet relic, as the last one right there. Here we go. We have the slab pack right now. It's guaranteed to be, guaranteed to be an eight or above, and it is going to be, if I can work it out of the package, it's a J-Rod Tops Fire to the Moon Rookie insert card. Man, that is a sweet-looking card right there. Very, very nice. So they definitely did not cut any corners on cost. I feel like that pack exceeded the price of the pack. Again, check out the feedback. Make sure everybody else's packs check out and have positive feedback. Great pack right there. There's the number if you want to grab one of those from Michael at MC Collectibles. Thanks very much. That was a fun one to open up. All right, we've got time for, I think, one more because i got to get to a Little League game. We'll go ahead and finish this one up with a $15 pack. It says, long-time viewer of your channel. I've been to... Uh, I've been a longtime baseball card collector and have been collecting heavy for the past 25 years. Watching your Mystery Box Monday episodes inspired me to make mystery packs that are affordable for everyone to buy. At the same time, I want to have an assortment of baseball cards that every collector will enjoy. 50 packs were made up, and three of them were randomly selected right here. They're called the BG3 Hit Baseball Mystery Packs, and they have 13 cards. Three of the 13 are autos or relics, and 10 will be a, a random assortment of stars, rookies, Bowman first, short prints, etc. And they're $15 a piece. If you like what you see, the number is right here, 195-752-367-241. You type that in, it'll bring it right up if there's still inventory remaining. It's from BGS or BG Sports 2013. It says, thanks again, Jabs. I hope you enjoy opening the packs. If you're ever in Washington County, get a hold of me. I'll be going to Washington County soon, June 17th. The big card show, June 17th, 300 tables. It's like the Mid-Atlantic National, if I could give it a just a unofficial name i always hear about this dallas card show with 300 tables well we've got you matched with this june 17th washington county i went to actually lived there for four years went to college there great county all right here we go 13 cards let's check it out got luis arias starting things off so it'll be a mixture of 10 cards on the top rookies stars like albert pujols Nolan Gorman right there, Aaron Judge. And here comes the hit. Jason Giambi relic is the first one. We've got Ripken Reyes, first Bowman Auto, and Reese Hoskins, number to 300. So definitely some recognizable names there. Um, not dollar autos from the no-name dollar box at a card show. Everyone knows Reese Hoskins. Most of you know Jason Giambi. Some of you may have heard of Ripken Reyes. All right, here's the next one up. Hedbert Perez leads things off. A Ken Griffey Jr. from Allen and Ginter. We've got Seth Beer, rookie, Icy. There's a Jazz Chisholm. And Adley Rashman, rookie cards, and they're very nice. Ronnie Dawson is going to be the first of the three hits. Rookie auto numbered to 199. Daz Cameron, nice sapphire auto right there. And we have a Nuevi Marte quad relic, flawless, showcase out of 25. He's a nice prospect. This is a recent one. He's in his... He's in his Reds uniform right there, so that is a 2022 Flawless. Great card right there of Marte. And here we go. Last one of the video, folks. Thanks for joining us. Hit that thumbs up button. Love to have you along. Also, tap that notification bell so you get notified. One of these days, I'm going to go out in my garage and have a garage sale. And it, I don't know if it, it might not be tonight, but one of these nights, it's just going to be an impromptu. I'm just going to go ahead and start selling stuff from my garage. I've got 2 million cards out there, and I'm just sell them by the box. So if you have your notifications on whenever we go live, you'll get notified. Let's check out what we've got coming up here in this final pack. The BG packs. J-Rod. Platinum is in there. Chad Pender out of 75. Tops Tech is going to be the first one. Rookie Auto. Ryan Howard, former MVP, game use bat. And the final card, Hall of Famer. Man, that's a good one. Hall of Famer Tom Glavin. So th that's a great deal. 15 bucks. Uh three hits pretty much reminds me of the state classy packs that we uh, so often open but man uh, definitely some nice names in there with tom glavin so folks there you have it that is this edition of mystery box monday thank you very much for watching i hope you guys enjoy this one again we are we'll be back live tomorrow team break tuesday we've got lots of rounds lots of spots open if you want to jump in a round or two of the random team breaks we sell all of those spots on patreon so check out our patreon page if you're not signed up there, there's a link in the description. You can click on that and get signed up, and then you can buy into our breaks all month long. 
And uh, as long as you're a member, you have access to all of our breaks. So thanks for watching. Have a fantastic rest of your Monday, and I will see you all later. Good night, everybody.